Hey kids, today we're going to melt some gold. This is a nugget uh, that I've had for a while. Uh, some old jewelry and such that I've uh, smelted together, basically. Um, as you can see, I weigh it here. And it's in ounces, 0 0.1086. Some of the tools we'll be using. Uh, a crucible, some tongs, some 20 mule team borax. So, <clears throat> basically... Uh, the soap works as an insulator on the gold, reducing the uh, melting temperature of the gold. So we're going to add that on top of the gold before we put it in our coffee can forge. Let's do it. Okay, this is my coffee can forge that I uh, built a couple weeks ago. Uh, been playing with it. Uh, pretty easy to build. Uh, just a coffee can, some insulation, some clay. As you can see, uh, we've got a steel nipple on there, so I can uh, put my propane torch uh, in through there. Some uh, wool or kale wool insulation as a door. Fire up my prep propane torch here, and basically we just stick it uh, in the side of the coffee can forge through the steel nipple. And uh, the chamber is real small, so. And the insulation it heats it up to uh, hot enough to melt gold so go ahead and stick it in there in my crucible and uh, put the door on there and uh, we'll see see if we can melt this gold three minutes 22 seconds uh, looks like she's getting pretty hot I don't think we're quite there yet uh, let her cook a little longer. By the way, that V in the top of the insulation is an exhaust vent. Been pouring the coal to her here for 9 minutes 40 seconds and we got liquid gold. Look at that, kids. Into the water, instantly solidifies. Well, you can see we got uh, three pieces of gold out of that. I split apart when I hit the water. Let's uh, weigh it and see what we got. Zero it out, go to ounces, and put our gold on the scale. Oh, lost one there. Looks like uh, 0 0.1072. Not quite what we had. But who knows, I've always been good at losing money.